Okay, we're going to have a quick look at the dashboard now. The dashboard is a new feature in Mirad 4. It's located at the top of the log screen, and its job is to tell you what's playing, what's coming next, and dependently of what's in the log screen down here. So to see the dashboard in action, the first thing we need to do is push the power button to actually start active playout mode. As you can see there, it's uh, picked up Gwen Stefani is playing. Um, playing currently in cart player A. Next item's play is the sweeper in cart player B and then later we're going to have turnaround by Lee Ryan. Um, that's also available down in the log here but as I scroll down in the log um, the dashboard remains in its normal place uh, so you can always see what's coming up now and what's coming next. You can also control output in the log here in the dashboard so you can change the ending types up in the dashboard to change from a, a stop to a go. Um, you can also dump items so I can remove the item to play next um, and that updates the dashboard. If I change the items in the log down here so if I take Rogue Traders and say I'm going to play that next then again the dashboard updates to tell us that. Here we've got the countdown to the end of the item. This countdown here also actually tells us to when the, uh, the log's going to stop next. So at the moment we're going to stop at the end of Gwen Stefani, but if I change that to be a green and then say we're actually going to stop after Lee Ryan, you can now see we've got a countdown going from 7 minutes 25 seconds because that's the next time the log will actually stop. Uh, we've got total duration, we've got um, some timing information and overrun information up here. This is slightly different to the gap time which is down here. The gap time is actually the time to the next time, uh, time event in the log whereas the overrun is for the whole hour. Um, you've got a pause and you can even right click in the bar here to jump around like you can in a cart player. In essence the dashboard uh, gives you an alternative way of viewing what the cart players are doing um, but it does mean that you can um, either use the traditional mirrored methods or use the new dashboard.